All right, guys, what is up? This is Brandon coming out to the brand new video today. It is a very, very exciting day. Probably the most exciting day this car will ever have. So, as you saw in the last video, something big was coming for the car. I was going to tell you guys. I didn't tell you what it was, but I said it's going to be the most expensive thing I'd probably buy for the car. And they are here, right here. I'll give you a glimpse. I'm guessing you guys may know what these are. But these are new wheels for the Subaru. So, super excited. These have been wait. I've been saving up for about two and a half months. Uh, just got them today. Actually, they're from Aspire Motoring. Um, the only hint I'll give you, they're ESR. So we're going to start opening up real quick. Cole's here to get the official unveiling as well. So not going to be mounted today because I don't have the tires yet. But um, let's unbox these. All right, dudes. So you can pan the camera down a little bit. So it came in two boxes for the set of four. Um, so let's open up. This one's upside down. So we'll just open up the other one. So like I said, these are from Aspire Motoring. Um, it was actually a long process to get these. Uh, originally, they said it was a possible fraud because I had my billing address was separate from my shipping address, which is understandable. So after that, all I figured out um, we're all good. So here we go. Woo! Ooh, boxes. Boxes, dude. Right. This is so aids the film, dude. I can't do it. <laughs> oh. Dude, <laughs> check this box out. So these are 18 by 8.5 ESR, um, 5 by 100 bolt pattern. Um, the finish is right here. I'm not going to show Cole yet. So basically, Cole doesn't know what color these are. Um, I know what color these are, but I haven't seen them in person. So here's what the plan is. I'm going to have it set like this. I'm going to do my reveal, and I'm going to have Cole see it. So here we go. Here's my official uh, first taste of these wheels, dude. Yeah, Colby, keep your keep your eyes closed. And we won't show the camera. Oh, dude, the box art is pristine. Oh man, I gotta look. Alright. Oh my gosh, these look really good. Is the camera even on you? It's on me perfect, so you, they don't see what the color is. Oh, <laughs> Dude, they look so good. Okay, I already know what they look like, so I'm gonna get let Cole get the reaction now. So I'm gonna take the camera. All right, so Cole, he's the first one to see these in person. There's still the white wraps. So you have to take the white wrap out. All right, so I already like them, dude. These are good. Woo! Is that, is that gun metal, dude? <laughs> that is. Yeah. That's pretty nice, dude. All right, you guys ready for the reveal? Here we go. All right, dudes, they look insane. So, here is the official reveal of the new wheels. All right, so as you can see, these are the ESR SR01s, 18 by eight and a half gun metal. So it's got the gun metal gray uh, face and then the lip is silver. So I'm gonna stop recording for a second. I'm gonna get it out of the box and whatnot. And then we're gonna clean everything up and we're gonna test it. All right guys, so we managed to squeeze the car into the garage. So I'm just gonna take off this wheel um, and then we're gonna test fit the first wheel uh, just to see if I'm gonna need spacers and whatnot. Um, it's a pretty aggressive offset for Subaru. So um, at the end of this video, I'll talk about all the specifics of these wheels and of the tires that are gonna be coming and whatnot like that. Um, but so right now, we're just gonna test fit them and see if they fit. So. Gonna unbolt these ones and I'll get back to you guys once the tire is off. All right, dudes. So we have them, or one of them tested right now. Oh my gosh, it looks insane. It is so cool. So I think the coolest part is how beefy these are. And I'm actually surprised. I don't think I need spacers. Um, I might get a little bit of spacers, like the, some thin spacers, but I actually don't think I might need some. It's the clearance is perfect. So let me show you the rear point first. Cole's heading out. Uh, but. Here is the rear. So I don't know if you can tell, but even without the tire, it's so much beefier. So it's an eight, eight and a half. I think the stock is six and a half, I think. Um, and I'll show you the side. So here it is, dudes. It looks incredible. Like I said, it's still on, it's still high. So, you know, it's not, of course, gonna be this high. But dude, they look insane. The dish is exactly what I'm looking for. And just overall, dude insane like the clearance is great for the uh caliper and a little close there so that's why i was thinking maybe a little bit of small spacers but um 
So yeah, now just to get the tires. So this next clip is going to be probably later at night, and it's just going to be talking about exactly everything I chose with these wheels and why I chose them and whatnot. So I'll catch you guys tonight. All right, guys. So it is now, um, like I said, it's actually the next night um, since the wheels were unveiled. And this is going to kind of be uh, just this last section here. Um, this, Like I said, this video... I'm not going to be installing the wheels because I'm still waiting on tires, my lug nuts, and my hub-centric rings. Um, but this is just kind of a video really unveiling and revealing um, what's been going on with this car for the longest time, why nothing's happened to this car. Um, so this is going to be a little bit more of a longer talking section. Um, but for anybody who's got an 02 to 07 WRX, um, I went through months of struggling trying to figure out, you know, saving up number one, but also trying to figure out what sizes and all that fun stuff to look for so that's for you guys if you guys have an 0207 wx um if you're looking for these kind of wheels or any kind of esr wheels or really any wheels um here's all the information that i've learned um and even if you don't uh here's just if any if you guys are at all interested in aftermarket wheels so like i said at the beginning of this video these are esr 18 or the ESR SR01, 18 by eight and a half. So the wheels are 18 by eight and a half. Um, and I was debating on eight and a half or nine and a half. Um, but I finally made the decision for 18 by eight and a half, um, which I'm actually pretty happy with the decision. It worked out perfectly. Um, so that is the size I picked. And then the only offset that was available with this size was plus 30 offset. So I'm gonna talk about this for a second. For some WX owners out there that may trigger you a lot. Um, when I was reading in forums, really everybody said stay away from like anything under 40 um, because stock, the Seabreeze have a really high offset of like 45, 55, something like that. It's really, really high offset. So people were really against a 30 offset. Um, but I was like, you know what? These are the wheels I've really, really wanted. These are the wheels I've been saving up for, for months on end. Um, I'm gonna go with it and if I have to do some modifications to the car, I'm completely okay with that and so far Especially since I'm on stock suspension um, that won't be there Stock suspension is gonna stay like that until the end of winter and then I'm gonna upgrade to coilovers But for right now, it's gonna be good. So like I said 30 offset and as you saw they fit Perfectly flush They're like I couldn't ask for better fitment I might give a small spacer just so I have a good distance from the struts. So that's the only thing I'm kind of nervous I mean, it should be fine um, but I don't know how it's going to act with the tire on there. So like I said, 18 by eight and a half plus 30 offset. Um, like I said, this is the gun metal, um, SR01. Uh, so I picked these up off Aspire Motoring. Um, so check them out. Um, and for any of you guys with an 02 to 07 WX, you are looking for a, uh, five by 100 bolt pattern. So, um, depending on your sizes, it will depend on like which ones are available. So this is is the 5 by 100 bolt pattern as you saw it fit. So that is that. And then for tires, um, which have not came in yet, but I am getting BF Goodrich Comp 2s, um, which are basically BF Goodrich's version of the Michelin Pilot Super Sports, which are like one, in my opinion, the best tire out there. Um, I am kind of biased on BF Goodrich Comp 2s and Michelin's because my dad um, works. He's one of the heads at uh, BF Goodrich for his certain plant. So I, I'm, I'll admit I'm kind of biased towards BF Goodrich and Michelin, but I think they're amazing. Um, so like I said, I'm getting uh, Michelin, or BF Goodrich Comp 2s. Um, I'm getting 235 by 40, or 235 by 40 R18s. Um, I finally kind of learned what all that stuff means. So, um, but that's the tire size I'm going with. I think it should look really good. Um, those should be coming within the next few days. I also ordered some JDM lug nuts. Um, and then the final thing, like I said, I, need, I, I still need to get are some hub centric rings. I'm going to try and look around a couple stores, see if they have them before I buy some online and have to wait a week for them to ship. So hopefully these within a week, these wheels should be mounted. Um, that's the hope week or week, week and a half. Um, but yeah, so that's basically, you know, I, I've been saving since the beginning of July. Um, you know, I work at a grocery store, so I, I do not make a lot of money. I make, you know, just enough. Um, and, uh, you know, also to buy these along with, uh, you know, still buying gas for the car every week and paying my insurance every month. It's, um, you know, I, 
it takes a while to save up, but you know, it's well worth it. These wheels are incredible. Every time I look at them, I'm just so excited to put them on. Um, and yeah, like I said, if you guys have any questions at all dealing with these wheels, um, the joyous thing is you can contact me on social media. I know a couple of you guys have actually contacted me um, in the past couple of days um, about a wing, the uh, STI wing, um, questions about that, which was really cool. I love, love, love answering questions the best I can for you guys. So um, my Instagram is always in the description below, but it's Braden.h underscore. Um, so that is my Instagram. Um, I am actually starting up a partnership with Cole. Um, we're going to be starting up a business soon. So that's going to be something that's kind of being unveiled on this channel as well. But tomorrow is going to be something really cool. My buddy Landon's got a really cool BMW 335i, I think is what it is. I don't know much about BMWs, but I think it's something like that. And he's basically getting it straight pipe tomorrow. So that's going to be really exciting. So that video is going to be coming out soon. Um, probably not till the end of the week or something like that. But like I said, guys, if you have any questions at all about these suckers or anything like that, feel free to contact me. Um, and hopefully within the next week these will be on the car so like i said i'm still like super ecstatic it's been so long and now that i have these it's going to be a lot easier to get some cheaper mods uh, i've already bought a couple of things but thank you guys so much for watching um i thank you for all the support i'm sorry i've been gone for a while i'm hoping to kind of get back into it again with the school year but like i said guys thank you for watching and peace